Oh. Oh, right. welcome back. Happy Friday to you. Hope you've all had a good week. The trailer for David Cronenberg's Crimes of the Future just dropped about 45 minutes ago. There was a teaser and an international trailer that came out two or three weeks ago. If you did want to see my video reaction to both of those, the link's in the description down below. Both of those trailers seem to be very different about how they marketed the film, but across them both, one thing did become certain. It did seem that the master of body horror, David Cronenberg, was back. Looking forward to this film, curious about this film. It's out in about four weeks' time. I think it's making its debut at the Cannes Film Festival. It stars Viggo Mortensen, who of course did work with Cronenberg before with History of Violence and Eastern Promises. It also stars Leia Sadu and Christian Stewart, so we've got some awesome talent both in front of the camera and behind. Those first two trailers gave us hints about what to expect. It does seem that we're going into the sci-fi body horror genre once more. From what I've seen online, it is a red band trailer, so chances are the footage we're getting probably isn't going to be for the squeamish. So if you are sensitive to that sort of thing, watch it anyway. Broaden your horizons. I'm here for it. Let's take a look. I can feel you pulling things around in there. <clears throat> it's a brand new organ. Brand new organ? Never before seen. We've all felt that the body was empty. Empty of meaning. And we've wanted to confirm that so that we could fill it with meaning. The world is a much more dangerous place now that pain has all but disappeared. Surgery is sex, isn't it? Is it? Mm. You know it is. Surgery is the new sex. Sex? Is I don't what like she what's said? happening with the body. In particular, what's happening with my body. Which is why I keep cutting it up. What do you think they'd find inside it? Outer space. Oh. Oops. Sorry. Blurred lines again, man. Let us not be afraid to map the chaos inside. Creator, that will guide us into the heart of darkness. Oh. That's some sort of rebirth there at the end. Almost kind of speechless. From the previous trailers, I kind of knew what to expect. From seeing his older films, I kind of know what to expect. Again, we've got those blurred lines, that, that whole juxtaposition of pain and pleasure. And they kind of seem to be leaning very heavily into those themes. Some of that imagery and those, some of those bodies that were cut up and modified, and stitches. And there was the dancer, I think I read before, that Viggo Mortensen plays performance artist that puts on these public shows of his metamorphosis and it looks like he's pushing it to further and further extremes. Yeah, definitely a red band trailer, with that stomach split and then what followed on after that. Similar to the themes we saw in Crash all those years ago. And I can remember in the UK in particular what an uproar there was when that film came out. I think it was close to getting banned at some point. I know all the Daily Mailers were getting very upset about it all. Can't think why. But yeah, this looks really good. I'm really curious as to where it's going to go. The trailers are giving us lots of imagery, but there's still no real hints as to the journeys for the characters. Viggo Mortensen's character does seem to be on quite some journey, from what I can tell. And there seems to be some sort of triangle there between his character and Leia Sidhu's and Kristen Stewart. I made that comment earlier about blurred lines between pain and pleasure. But I do remember now there was a line in the trailer about pain almost disappearing. So it could well be that these modifications are some way of feeling something new, having some sort of new sensation or emotion. From what I can tell, it looks to be particularly addictive. Not necessarily for me, but for the characters. There seems to be some sort of addiction there and then pushing it further and further and further. Yeah, I'm really intrigued. I really want to see it. What do you think? Is this kind of film your thing? I'm guessing if you found this video on any sort of search engine, this is clearly a genre that you're probably already into, which is why you're seeking it out. So maybe it was just a stupid question to begin with. But yes, do let me know what you think. Leave comments down below. If you want to follow me on Instagram or Twitter, you can do so here. And as always, here's my begging part. If you could please like this video, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell. In terms of subscribers, I'm a small channel, but I'm nearly hitting a new benchmark. So if you want to follow the channel, get me there. When I say get me there, I mean get me to the, the number, not get me there. 
that would be much appreciated. On that less than sordid note, I will leave it there. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed the trailer. And I hope to see you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.